Warning, this is a pest control video and it will show pests being controlled with air rifles. If this is likely to offend you, then please stop watching now. For the rest of you who like these type of videos, let's get on with the action. Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Pontypool Pest Control. In today's video, I'm at one of my permissions that is having a few problems with the rabbit numbers. So who better to have on your side than the sheriff? As cute as these rabbits may be, I'm here to help protect the horses. If they were to get their legs stuck in a rabbit hole or break their leg, it can lead to a very costly vet bill or the horse may need to be put down. There's also a few small ponies and an horse menage in the background or a riding area. I have seen a lot of youngsters learn to ride here in the past, so I try to keep on top of things as much as I can to keep them all having fun and also to keep away any unwanted bills from the landowners. This is one of the problems I was telling you about. There are holes out in the field. Any horse or person walking by is just an accident waiting to happen. So let's get into the shooting. This is one of the locations that I like to shoot from. It's a nice eye point and I can also tuck in and hide behind the grass. It also gives me a good view of all the likely places that the rabbits are going to appear from. When I'm out hunting, if things start to go slow, I just move positions but I always try to blend in with my surroundings. I like to sit back and listen to the birds and enjoy being outdoors. Sometimes we might go home empty handed, but that's all in a day's work. We just carry on and try again. This is a rabbit's view of the eye point that I like to shoot from. Can you see me? Hey, 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 there's the sheriff. As I was sat waiting for more rabbits to come out, I noticed one in the bottom field. I quickly range found it and it was 55 yards away. I knew this rabbit had spotted me, so I had to take the shot from where I was. I was very confident in making the shot. I set the gun onto the trigger sticks and I began to take aim. They don't call me the sheriff for nothing, that stiffened him right up. The rabbits had gone quiet for a minute, but I spotted a pigeon land in a tree. I set up the camera and tried to find it. Soon enough, there it was, with a nice opening, begging for the sheriff to take the shot. The pigeon was 63 yards away. The conditions was perfect and I knew I could make this shot. So again I took aim on the trigger sticks and waited to pick the right moment to send the shot.
Now that was some shot with a sub 12 foot pound air rifle. The sheriff is ready to lose some weight and he speeds off to retrieve the pigeon, ready for the pot. Let's take another look at that shot in slow motion to see where it landed, and then we'll take a look at some crosshairs action. That 63 yard head shot landed perfectly, and I couldn't have placed it any better even if the shot was at 10 yards. A new day and we're also on a new permission. Still using the same technique, I sat out in the long grass. There was a lot of wind on this day, I turned some of it down in the video editing. I was making my way back to the jeep as I was ready for home. Then I seen something that I'd never seen before on his permission. I'm pretty sure it's a monk jack. All you hunters out there please let me know in the comments below. I had to get my camera out of the rucksack as this is something I might not ever see here again. The best way to tell if you shot a young rabbit or half grown 
is they will always jump around even if you make a perfect headshot. Some situations we can't tell the size of the rabbit, but we know for sure that we're shooting at one. Sadly it's our time again, we've come to the end of the video. The kit that I was using is the FX Impact Mark 1 in 177 calibre, and the scope was the Pad 008 LRF. The pellets was the JSB Exacts 8.44 greens. Sorry I haven't uploaded in ages, the field target season has started back, and I'm shooting the best that I ever have, so I've been putting in my best efforts. Thank you very much for sticking by me, and for giving me all the support that you do, it really means a lot to me. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing, not to miss out on any of my upcoming videos. Thank you very much for watching, keep safe, all the best, Pontypool Pest Control, aka The Sheriff.